In every election cycle, there are events that don't live up to their advanced hype. I wouldn't say that the November 4th rally here in Providence for Libertarian Vice Presidential Candidate Bill Weld actually qualified in that category. That's mainly because there was no advance type. Are you kidding me? Rhode Island State Libertarian Party Chair Pat Ford did everything he could to let folks know in advance. Better known as Pat from Cumberland on Ocean State Talk Radio, Ford was only able to put up a Facebook event. Hey, the Libertarians have been trying to prove they can run a credible national campaign on the kind of budget the late Bob Healy would have regarded as stingy. So let's give them some credit for sticking to their platform. Veep candidate Weld apparently did his part towards holding down expenses. He organized the event in Providence for purposes of minimizing the mileage he'd have to expense for the round trip from his home in Rentham, Mass. Because he did, however, the plenty points he got for putting $2 worth of gas in his tank for the trip will also have to be turned over to the National Party. There's no word yet on how many Rhode Island voters attended. But that's okay, too. As of the date of our taping, no one has asked for that number either. So would you say that the Libertarian ticket had only a small impact on the election results here in Little Rhodey? Are you kidding me?